So hello guys, here we have a, a Delphi MIP2 infotainment system. So here we have the mine unit version is 624 and the software train version is uh, 220 distant for, for Delphi. With toolbox you cannot uh, patch this thing and you cannot activate Android Auto or CarPlay. So first of all, you have to open the developer mode with OBD11 or another scanning uh, tool. Then you have to format a SD card. I will link the files in the video description and copy those files in this in the roots of this SD card. But first of all, you have to format the SD card in FAT32 format. So uh, I already connected OBD11 to my car. So we have we have to go to multimedia and then <coughs> let me let's wait. Then change service to developed mode. And then we have to go to adaptation and then we have to activate the developer mode to our radio I already activated mine but was not activated so activate it And now I'm going to show you how to install it. It's just easy. So first of all, if you have a navigator SD card, you have to remove it and then plug your SD in the first slot of your infotainment. Just turn on your car, just in case your battery is not good. Then hold the menu button for some seconds and go to software, go to update from SD card. This is the file activated by Congo and Duke. Then you have to press start. I already done it so it will uh, show sometimes just black screen don't worry it's just normal it, the unit is going to reboot like two or three times and then you have to restart it yourself and then go to menu app connection and will be able to show the Android Auto and Able CarPlay let's test if, if it's going to work so I'm connecting the phone. Okay, as you can see, it really works. So you can navigate. You can use all the other features. You can use Spotify and all the things you want. It's just perfect. In this model, it works.
thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you have any other question you can leave it in the comments below